Hi guys, it's Kristen from Six Sister Stuff and today I'm sharing with you three five minute meals. Now it's fall time, we all know things get busy. We have a lot on our plates and so a five minute meal is sometimes all the time that I have to make dinners. I hope you guys like our recipes. Okay, let's go make them. The first recipe that I'm making today is called pizza quesadillas. So I am cooking my tortillas right now. I've already flipped them once. Um, these are the kinds that are not pre-cooked, so I made them cook a little bit longer. But anyways, first I added my sauce on, then I added my cheese. Um, on the other side of the skillet is another tortilla cooking. You can't see it right now, but I'm just warming it up so it's all ready to go when I put it on top of this one. All right, then I added my pepperonis. You can add any toppings you want. Um, my girls like ham and pineapple, but my husband loves pepperonis. So then I added a little bit more cheese on top, and then put my other tortilla on, flipped it, cook it for a little bit longer to melt all the cheese, and you are done. The next recipe I'm making is called healthy tuna pitas. So I have my can of tuna. Now this tuna is in water instead of oil. And then I added a little bit of mayonnaise or Miracle Whip, about two tablespoons of that. And mix that just for a minute. I added a little Dijon mustard because I like a little bit of kick, about, oh I don't know, two to three teaspoons of that. Then salt and pepper to give it a little more flavor and mix it really well. Now it's time to put our pitas together. Now, just word of warning, if you get the Greek pitas, they don't open, the pocket doesn't open, just so you know. All right, so in my pita, I like to put lettuce on the bottom, then I put about half of the tuna mixture that I made right on top of the lettuce. I added some cucumbers and tomatoes. If you don't like those, you can add sprouts or other vegetables that you would love with it. Um, then I like to put some guacamole just on top because it makes it taste even better. And that's really how simple and easy this recipe is. Only about five minutes to throw together. And the last recipe I'm making today is called avocado chicken salad sandwich. It really is so easy. So this is my rotisserie chicken. I just took a little bit of the chicken breast out, chopped it up into small pieces, um, we like bite size here. Then I took my, it's a half a cup measuring cup. Um, it's a little bit more than half a cup, but just so you can get a measurement. And then I had one package of the mini holy guacamole. Um, add that to about a half a cup of chicken. So this is going to make two sandwiches. So if you need a bigger, if you were making food for a bigger group, I would either double this or triple this depending on how much you need. But anyways, mix your guacamole and your chicken together are really good. You can add salt and pepper, but the guacamole has so much flavor, and I feel like it really doesn't need it. Then I just put it on top of my buns and close it up. Now if you don't have any guacamole, you could also use avocados, smash them up, add a little salt and pepper, and maybe even a little salsa in there. It would taste delicious. But having the little mini holy guacamoles make it so fast and so easy. There you go. Five minutes and you're done. Thanks for joining me today on Six Sister Stuff. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel. Bye guys!